Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Super Robot Tyson D at Destiny's End. We're still dealing with the Ruina. And the Ruina is going to get ruined in a matter of moments. As Aquila shows his face. As we take out the last of the first wave of the Rona. Go Sugar Beam! So how about we do a little speed up? That'll work. And we're gonna do the same thing like we did before. Have them come to us. Give it to him, Gamlin! Because I think it's time to go there. Once again. Thunder Punch! Really, sir? No. Get ready to taste some Vulcan. Thank <laughs> you. 
Sir, consider yourself blessed. Subasa no Ikari. Otherwise known as the wings of light. Gonna to try to take on the tower. Beside it, Hacha! Maybe I didn't hear, uh, maybe I didn't say it clearly enough. I said, Miss. Hasha! Dash, 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 dash. You know, every once in a while, Amaro should just not wear the suit. But he should just wear his normal suit. Missile! What's up? It's Mac Ross. You gotta have your missiles. Target locked. Fire. Don't fuck with hero shit or else he'll fuck you up. How about some Flash Vulcan?
How about something in your face? And you don't want none of that in your face, huh? Just be grateful they're not together, or else you really get some fucked up shit. But a blitzkrieg! I see you guys are trying to act elite now. God, you bastards. Mouse of blood! Gonna be like that. Fine, we can play your game. Overdrive now.
Nice! Try to do a chain attack, eh? Ow. Miss. You bitch! And now, a killer comes out to play, and... Yeah, it's 32,000 32, HP, plus a little 200 on the side. Well, that didn't work out so well. What's that again? Screw that, we're gonna go attack this dude right here. So after some banter, it's showdown time with Aquila. Thunder Punch! Total miss. That afterburn, man. That afterburn. Okay, fine, that works. Okay, Nataku, maybe you can do something, I don't know. Atomic punch. Ah, so he can be scarred. Yeah, that's that's Oh, 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 oh. 
Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, damn. Oh, oh. Assist! Oh, yeah, that works too. Strike on! And the tower is giving considerable damage since I put strike on. I'm gonna need a assist attack here. Cause even if I miss, <laughs> even if I miss, I have backup. This new Gundam is not for show, it is for kicking ass. Now you look at this attack animation, this is just insane. Oh, we're not giving a damn about the the little um, maggot over there. Oh, that is beautiful, Uso. Put his butt in the sling. Just missed. Oh, God. You want some tail? Yoink. Uh, no, sir. Oh, 
Oh, you don't want one? He's either going to evade or defend. I think he's going to evade. Oh no! You're not doing either. You're just getting blown the fuck up. So, Aquila tells Contagio that he's retreating. And leaving the rest in. And two levels gain for gambling. So we can get rid of this little dingle bear right here now. I know he's trying to evade. Sad thing is, we're sick and tired of your ass. So, now, the team enters the big hole and finds a base. Inside is Glacius, and of course Josh is going to deploy. In this case, what I'm going to do... Do a little switch up. I got seven more to choose from, so...
So here we are. Lashies versus Josh. So yes, I brought along Godmar's Grandizer and Daltonus. And I'm going to do the same thing as I did in the last battle. Have them come to us. Just like the last battle, what you want to do is have all your enemies just come right at you. Just, just come, just let them come right at you with just one big... God Fresh! Anyway, what you need to do is have them all come right up to you and just, like a big sandwich, have them all, you know, mesh them all together, bam. God the fresh! And the God Flash is missing. God the Flash! And God Flash is constantly missing. My tricks! Kill! Martyrix! Kill! Which just somehow missed. This is gonna be one of those Difficult battles because you're dealing with dodgy bastards this time. You're not dealing with straight out. So accuracy is a definite must in this battle. Now the phone is ringing, which I'm not going to answer. Give him the tackle. Drop him like a bad habit. Grandizer, do you have anything to bring to the table? Oh. 
And your drill crusher punch just misses. And this is why, Grindizer, I never choose you. Go, Chudo! He said, no, I'm gonna have to break your ass in hand. Don't you realize I will most of you kick your ass? Don't tell me, you're gonna move out the way? No, you're not? How good of you to do that. And yeah, I haven't used Camille in a while, so. Point blank to the face. Point blank to the face. Raise that crit rating. Grilma, if you so please. Oh, come on. And this is for people who love the red gum. Missile, Hasha. Even if I had the glare to do it, I'm going to do it. And now we turn to now we turn to the the other the other Voltron. <laughs> no, seriously.
seriously, Dozenus was about to be like the third Voltron. Of course, I, I just wouldn't see that. Del Deltonus as a third Voltron, I, I, I just can't see it. Misses every goddamn time. That works. Almost every time, that works. Could you pause? No, never mind. All right, BD, can you please help us out here? Thank you. Hey, it don't matter as long as it hits. So you want that?
Press the button! Oh, and here you can in this battle you can actually have the choice of either saving her or you know letting her go. Glacies that is. Yes, Great Mosgar can take the hit for Doltonus. If it were, if it were so, I would say this. Have Deltanus, Dyrugger, and Golion show up in one in one battle together. Make up something like a FDS. And for those who don't know what FDS means, it's Final Dynamic Special. I would like to see something like that. Just, just, just between the three of them. Press the button! That works. Okay, let's see if your sorry ass can actually do something, Grindizer. Anger of Storm. Doesn't matter. Space Thunder, Anger of Storm. Something, dude. Kento, god damn it. <laughs> I do a chain tag. Ow. Ow.
all the time. Those lion blasts ain't going to do jack to shit. Now we got the elites. And um, the elites. What can I say about those elites? Here's the stupid thing. This is what's going to happen. This is, this is going to open because I don't know why they have this uncanny ability just to open this thing for no apparent reason just because, oh, I'm right here. Get the beam! Okay, you got two versions. You got the chest and you got the in between the eyes. Get a beam! We got glaciers right there. Get to beam. Seems like it's the only way to actually beat these sons, baby. I don't really need a light since it's like 7 o'clock over here, almost before line 8. Got the flash! Getting on my nerves, so. Jet Scrinda! Sir, 
I'm sorry, but you gotta balance. Could you but possible? Never mind. Good night, let me take a good look at you. You're level 17. Everybody else is around 21-ish, 23. God damn. Duke Fleet, ladies and gentlemen. Compared to Shogo here, he's like freaking Bright Noah who can't hit for shit. And that's a terrible thing because at least Bright Noah that's frickin' white base, or the frickin' Argama, or the rock column, anything. Anything that can actually, by possibly, give him an edge of some sort, he can do. But Duke Flea can't hit for jack shit. And yes, I I'm telling it like it is. I'm telling it like it is. I say, if, if it not for sure, Amro, Kamiyu, and Judo. Oh, and everybody else in, in this group. That shall not be named, but you know them well. I mean, there is a way you can get the Faz or the full armor double Zeta. I think it has something to do with your hit rating. Like if you were an ace or something. It's the new types that are really doing the work around here. But at least the new types, they're actually doing something. Sorry for freaking Duke Fleet over there. Duke, I can't hit for shit, Fleet. We got BD who can hit. In comparison to everybody else, gaining levels. And 
in comparison to I can't hit shit Duke Fleet. At least the macros seven years can hit. Whether in fighter, girl walk, or bachelor, it don't matter. At least the Valkyrie units can hold their own. And then you got Dalton is here. Dalton is actually making an effort in this battle here. Atomic Punch! Okay, that's close. That's a mercy kill right there. Got freaking Kenryu, Doctor, and Gamlin. Oh, come on, Kenryu! Mitch Bastard. Well, that's my own goddamn fault because I didn't put Grendizer in enough battles. But then again, I never did like Grendizer. At last, you finally hit something, Duke. Duke the Nuke Fleet, ladies and gentlemen. Duke the Nuke Fleet. I'm sorry, I should call you Fluke, not Nuke. Because if you were hitting more than you, than you were just missing, then I will call you Nuke. Rock at the punch! So you need to be more like Koji over here. Duke nosebleed freed. But I get the punch! Good job, Koji. Kento? Don't make me slap you, man. Tetsuya took one for the team, man. Koji took two for the team. Oh, you bitch! Go 
hell, Jade. I'm so gonna heal you after. Oh, god damn. Go, sugar beam! Thank you. Because something has to be done. About these jackanapes here. Time to zang zip, zip zang. You have been zang zipped and zip the zang. And the sun design. Let the big dog eat. Let the big dog eat. Oh, the big dog wanted a bite. Assist! Thank you. So everybody in Get a Robo, of course, is going to gain a level. Ryoma, Hayato, and Benke. Benke, you can save that point for for a later date. Time to pull up the heavy hitters. I think with this lineup, I think we can we can pull it off. Let's hit a can! Here, it's not about the levels, just, just accuracy. Accuracy plays a big role. I have mentioned it before, 
accuracy does play the big role in this game. That and will. If you don't mind BD, I'm just going to reach over and touch someone. Point blank. They said yes. You said no. Oh, you a bitch. Do you realize you're a little bitch? Somebody hit those two, please. Thank you. Atomic Punch! Doctor, did you just take the hit? No, Gamlin took the hit. Thank you! Finally, we got rid of this butt monkey once and for all. Shit. So here she comes, the lady of the hour. Thank you for coming over. We were just about to ask. Oh, God, Mars, my dear friend. And just like before, she does have a map attack. Hurts like the Dickens. Assist! And here, hard enough, it can happen. Might as well give you the thunder punch. Thunder punch.
you and your frost sword. Oh, this is gonna be beautiful if it if it actually hits. Please give me that damage ratio. Thank you. <laughs> Good work, Double Zeta. Press the button! Oh, that is beautiful damage right there. That is some damage I can get behind. Thank you, Tetsuya. Thank you so much, Tetsuya. I would like to do something special. I like to scream out the two words that you will forever remember in the back of your head. Get the beam! Fine, you will not remember get a beam. But you will have the last double knuckle sandwich you will ever eat in your lifetime. Koji. Finish it the way it needs to be finished. How about some double knuckles? One to the face and one to your ass! Well, I can always play cheap now. Have your ass get run over by a motorcycle. Garland, if you please. <laughs> Ma'am, you just got beaten by a dude in a motorcycle. So, with Glacies down,
when Glacius is about to have it, then this happens. Contagio comes on and says that if she is to die, then she should make herself useful and go to the center core and blow up to create energy for the plant, as the Lord of Destruction would want. She agrees. So, Glacius retreats behind him, and her mech blows up. Contagia notes that this is the power that beat Ignis and Aquila and retreats for now. And Shogo, you have earned every bit of it. Ladies and gentlemen, Shogi, Shog, Shogo Yagi. Oh, but it's not over. Oh no, it, 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 it's definitely not over. So yes, we have not only taken out one boss battle, but we've taken out another boss battle, and on top of that, we got a their boss back. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to stop here. Next part, Contagio, ladies and gentlemen, Contagio. And it's Idiot Orchestra. So stay tuned. More SRW goodness right after this.